Number eight, what is the major product of the following reaction? We have this substrate and we have sodium cyanide. So we have Na plus and we have Cn minus. So Cn minus is an excellent nucleophile. In fact, it is an excellent SN2 nucleophile specifically because it is very linear, it is very bullet shaped. This is going to very readily perform SN2. We have an excellent leaving group. We have this bromo group right there. So this is going to attack and kick off the bromine. So what do we get? We get CN in the place of bromine, but we know that SN2 proceeds by a backside attack we are always going to invert the stereochemistry at the center where SN2 occurs. And so we're going to get CN where the bromine group was, but we're going to have it inverted so it's going to be a wedge instead of a dash. So it's going to be A. B doesn't work because although structurally we get the right answer, CN will not be on the dash bond, right? We need to have inversion of stereochemistry right there. C does not work because we went to the wrong place. We don't want the CN where the methyl was. We're definitely not kicking off the methyl group. Methyl group would be a terrible leaving group. So that doesn't work. And then the same thing here, we got that in the wrong place. We're seeing if we know, number one, what kind of nucleophile we have. We know that we have a CN minus nucleophile, which is a great SN2 nucleophile. We need to know it's going to displace the bromo leaving group. And we need to know that there will be inversion of stereochemistry. So that will be A.